there, Donna Woods with Photonic Health. Today I wanted to talk to you about utilizing red light therapy in combination with essential oils. We've been using light therapy since 2002 and got introduced to essential oils in about 2004, 2005. So we've been using the combination together for a very long time. And it's one of our favorite things that we like, uh, combinations of therapies that we like to blend together because we get really great results. And so we wanted to chat with you today about the basics and the ins and outs on how to get the best results while uh, safekeeping and maintaining your light. So first off, if you are going to use the combination of the two together, you want to make sure that you use uh, oil that is not photosensitizing or sensitive to light. We have included a list in our quick start guide so you can refer to that. Um, so you want to make sure that the that it's not photosen the oil is not a photosensitive oil and that especially pertains to like if you're going to apply an essential oil to your horse or your dog and if they out they're outside a lot or even a person if they're outside a lot or if it's the summertime and you just put an oil on and they go out and they have a reaction in the sun so be cautious of that. The second thing is that we have found that if you use light therapy, if you illuminate the area first and do the whole species first, so if you do all of your red lighting protocol first and then follow up with the essential oils and apply the essential oils last, this will have a longer lasting effect on the activation of the meridians and the activation of the cells and it's a really powerful combination together so our rule of thumb is always red light first and then apply your essential oils the last tip that we want you to be aware of pertains to your device so on your device you have this little it looks like a little plastic end it's actually made out of polycarbonate and it is handmade these little things are a little bit uh, costly to manufacture because of the handmade nature of them and essential oils will dull this and will actually create cloudiness on the lens so you always want to uh, red light first and then when you are completely done with red lighting then you want to apply your essential oils and make sure that the essential oils do not touch your device especially the tip of it so that you can ensure the integrity of the lens to make sure that you get the best light penetration possible so happy red lighting and enjoy your essential oils